What's up guys, this is P-Sensei. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to play NES games on your Nintendo DS. All you're going to need for this is a Nintendo DS. Any model will work. NDS, uh, 3DS, 2DS, DSi, all of them will work. You're going to need a flash card. The one I'm going to be using is the uh, R4 SDHC Dual Core from 2019. And you're also going to need a micro SD card. Also, make sure that you have your firmware for your flash card already on there. Um, I have a video for that in case uh, you haven't done that. But once you've done that, all you got to do is take your micro SD card, put it into your computer, and I'll show you guys what to do next from there. All right, so after you've put in your micro SD card into your computer, uh, you're going to go to, go ahead and go over to sourceforge.net slash projects slash NESDS. This is going to bring you to the SourceForge page for the emulator that we're going to be using, which is going to be NESDS. All right, once you're here, go ahead and just click on the download button. It should take a few seconds and it'll give you a zip file. You can go ahead and save that wherever you'd like. All right, and after it's finished downloading, you can then go ahead and go uh, locate that and go ahead and extract it. All right, so it's finished extracting. Also make sure you have your NES games ready. As you can see right here, I have Super Mario Bros. All right very classic game right here all right and i have it in an nes folder although you can just uh, have it um normally right here um that, that's fine too you don't have to put it in the folder all right so i'm just going to go ahead and put that into here all right and as you can see we have the nesds.nds file and of course we have our nes games so that's really all you need so just go ahead and copy the nes um your nes games and the nesds.nds over to your flash cart which i have right here all right, so just copy that over. As you can see, as we go to the uh, R4 micro SD card, as you can see, we have the NES game right here. And uh, we also have the NES DS to NDS. All right, and after, you, and after you've done that, you're pretty much done. So go ahead and extract your micro SD card from your computer, and I'll show you guys what to do next from there. All right, so once you've taken your micro SD card out of your computer, um, you can then put your micro SD card into your R4, like so. And then go ahead and put your R4 into your Nintendo DS. And then go ahead and boot the system up. Alright. And as you can see here, we have NESDS.NDS right here. So go ahead and open that. And boom, we are officially in here. Um, now just go over to your game. Mine is in the NES folder. And as you can see right here, we have Super Mario Bros. NES. Go ahead, launch that up. And as you can see, we have the Super Mario Bros. loading screen. But to see that it actually works, let's go ahead and hit start. As you can see, we are loading up Super Mario Bros. And uh, yeah, we're playing Super Mario Bros. NES games on the Nintendo DS. As you can see, the controls are working fine. Um, yeah, pretty responsive. Um, you're not no really noticing anything wrong happening. It looks pretty smooth. Um, uh, so yeah, as, as you can see, uh, game working perfectly fine here. Um, you also have some options that you can do. All right. So obviously all the buttons work, start, you know, whatnot. But if you tap on the touch screen right here, you actually get an options menu. Click on, um, file here. You can load ROM, you can have save states as well. All right. Um, go to the game. Uh, you can uh, mess with the input. If you don't like the input, um, you can change that. You can swap B and A if you want. Um, you can change it from NTSC to PAL. Basically, you can change it to Europe if you want. Uh, some extra stuff you can do here. Uh, okay. Uh, you can enable cheats, and uh, if there's a problem, um, you can debug right here as well. But yeah, I mean, uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and peace.